Hello, everybody, and welcome back yet again to another drum playthrough review. Thanks to everyone for tuning in and stopping by. Great to see you all here. For everyone who's brand new, by the way, hello and welcome. My name is Nick. I'm a drummer, a multi-instrumentalist, amongst other things, and the reason why we do videos like these is so that way we can best learn from drummers who are much better than we are, analyze their technique, and break it down to a nice and easy-to-digest form, and use that so that way we can ultimately make ourselves better musicians. And we've got a returning heavyweight on this channel. The dude is an absolute beast. I originally did a video on this guy a couple of, uh, about a month and a half ago, and I didn't know his name. I didn't, uh, I couldn't find it online anywhere. I, I, I was trying to search it and I just couldn't find any info about the dude, but the dude ended up finding the video, responding to it, and that was absolutely sick. We're gonna be taking a look once again at the drummer Yu Li from China. He plays for the band, I believe, Horror of Pestilence. He looks like he is going to be playing through a different song than what we got playing today. It's not Horror of Pestilence, but it is a playthrough for a different uh, song, different band, I believe. The name of the song, it looks like it's called Death Contract, and the name of the band looks like it's called Black Cure In. I have no doubts this dude's gonna absolutely nail it because the last playthrough that we saw was 280 BPM, absolutely insanely fast, crazy stuff. The dude had some absolutely insane killer technique, and there's a lot that we could learn from the dude, so we're definitely gonna be checking out another one of his playthroughs today. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Let's take a look and see what we got with this fella, and join us because I feel like it's gonna be an absolutely insane ride. Before we start, though, I check my YouTube analytics, as any good creator should, and only about 0.7% of you guys are actually subscribed to the channel. What are you guys doing with your lives? Go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. We do a lot of fun stuff and a lot of videos just like this on here. We're going to have a lot more fun content coming your way, so stick around. It's going to be a fun, fun journey. Well, without further ado, ladies and gents, let's go ahead and get into it, because this is going to be an absolutely sick playthrough. Yeah, this is going to be a sick playthrough, I can already tell right here. He's already getting into it, which is sick. I love the energy. Absolutely love the energy. It's not necessarily anything too crazy at the moment, which is which is funny. Because usually this guy plays some insane stuff. Oh, here we go. Yeah, dude's absolutely on point with this. Such a good playthrough. His energy is on point. He's loose. Excellent swivel technique as well. And the wrist technique is on point as well. He's keeping a nice and loose grip on the sticks, which is really good. It means he's not straining. Nice little six couple of pattern right there. He's got some excellent looking hair too. Ooh, tasty. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go. Let's go with the blast beats. So clean. And it's all very effortless. He's got his drum kit set up in a way so that way he doesn't have to move his arms around a whole bunch. It's all very centralized. Minimal effort in order to achieve the best sound with good power. And he's just, he's digging it too, that's the best part. Mm. Oh, that is so sick for Blast Beats. And he's 
so relaxed during the whole thing. Oh. Man, this dude kills it as a drummer, man. He really does. I love his cymbal work. about stuff like this, man. The energy is on point with this song. Mm. That was insanely good. I enjoyed that quite a bit. Well, without further ado, ladies and gents, let's go ahead then. We'll jump into the review because there's quite a bit there that we can break down. This is some excellent stuff right here. Well, gosh dang, this guy can certainly play the drums, that is for sure. Yu Lee is definitely a drummer that I feel like is going to blow up pretty soon here in the metal drumming community, just because the dude, he, he's absolutely insane. There isn't that many people that can play at that intensity and keep that loose while also staying that energetic throughout the entire playthrough. That's absolutely sick. Talking about that swivel technique, that swivel technique is absolutely insanely loose, insanely clean. Nothing too, like, you know, strained or anything like that. He's keeping it really nice and tight. His accuracy is on point. The power that he's got as well, it's insanely good, as well as his speed and everything. It's absolutely insane. I know with the Chinese government, it can get a little bit crazy over there sometimes, and I know for sure that, like... They're not really too keen on metal being like a music genre over there. So the fact that he's, you know, able to do this out of China is absolutely insane. And, you know, definitely good luck to him. You know, hopefully, you know, nothing happens with that. I think he's an absolutely sick drummer. He definitely deserves, you know, some more recognition. So with that being said, we're going to leave down below his channel name. We're going to link it up here as well, because the dude is an absolute legend. Definitely some insane chops going on there as well. He's got some really good fills going on. And a lot of that is from practice especially with stuff like that swivel technique. You're not going to get clean swivel technique like that unless you practice, so that's how you can definitely tell for sure he's put in the hours. Staying very loose with it, the wrist and the finger technique was also very good, very nice and well done. And he's not death gripping his sticks while he's doing it, which means that he's not straining, which is absolutely fundamental and key. Making sure you're not straining is the number one, number one reason that's going to hold you back from uh, being able to play faster. If you're straining, you're not going to be able to go as fast. What an excellent playthrough, I will say, that's for sure. It's someone, someone like you, Lee, I it definitely makes me really wonder uh, just how far I can take my drumming. Because if someone like him is able to, you know, come in here and do something absolutely insane like that, bro, it just inspires me the more all the time when I see stuff like that. Every day, I just get a little bit more inspired every time I see somebody who drums that excellent. So, with all that being said, y'all, that's the end of this playthrough review. So, thanks for tuning in and stop by. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. All that good stuff. And check out the channel because I've got a lot of videos very similar to this on here that you'll probably all like. So, with all that being said, y'all, that's the end of this one. So, thanks for tuning in and stopping by. I will see you guys in the next video. So, cheers, God bless, and have a great rest of your night.